So I'm a Jersey boy. And I should know from Maine, right? But I, I've spent several decades in this society, in this kingdom. And we got a recommendation several months ago, and I, and I, I just blinked. I blinked. And I went, I'm sorry, what? Because for all my time in the East, I've known someone who, who anchored this kingdom in the North. As, as those I love have anchored it in the South. And the idea that this order is incomplete in this way is grotesque. <laughs> His, their Majesty is invited to their court, Agatha Wanderer. thing I can say is I read this recommendation went, how the <laughs> something was that overlooked? Yeah, we, we both we both did. Um, it, it's there, there are places where we look at each other and go, how, how are we members of the Silver Crescent before this person? That's and that's ridiculous. You are <laughs> certainly one of those. And is there a medallion? Yes, Your Majesty. This was given to me by Sir Anna Dubay. That guy! Yeah. <laughs> he wears his fluid leaves upside down. Oh, right side up. In the barony of Onderwear, there is a gentle known as Agatha Wanderer. Long has she toiled for the surrounds, making teaching both beautiful and practical designs. She is generous of her time and skill, teaching and volunteering, and lending of her knowledge and talent. This is most important as we, Emperor Brennan and Empress Keelan, desire her to have all within our kingdom to be most talented and adept. Having heard such good that this most esteemed noble, we would induct her into our Order of the Silver Crescent. Calligraphy and illumination by a Lady Elena Osidirium, wordsmith Lady Marion of Ruintalen. Please. Reach your order. Yeah,